Welcome to the Lean Fishbone Process Training. Today, we'll explore how to use the Fishbone Diagram, also known as the Ishikawa Diagram, for root cause analysis in problem-solving scenarios. This tool is essential for identifying the root causes of problems and developing effective countermeasures. The Fishbone Diagram is a visual tool used to systematically identify potential causes of a problem. It is called a fishbone diagram because of its shape and is also known as the Ishikawa diagram, named after its creator, Kaoru Ishikawa. Its primary purpose is to facilitate root cause analysis by breaking down the problem into contributing factors. The structure of the fishbone diagram consists of a central spine leading to the main problem statement, with bones representing categories of potential causes. Typically, these categories include the six MS, man, machine, method, material, measurement, and mother nature, environment. This structure visually represents the relationship between a problem and its potential causes, allowing teams to focus on specific areas during the analysis. Let's break down the six MS. Man refers to human factors such as training or skills. Machine includes equipment and technology used in the process. Method covers the procedures or standards followed. Material refers to the raw materials or inputs. Measurement involves inspection or quality checks, and Mother Nature represents environmental factors like temperature or humidity. Analyzing these categories helps in systematically identifying potential problem areas. Creating a fishbone diagram involves five steps. First, define the problem statement clearly. Next, identify the main categories to be used. Then, brainstorm potential causes under each category. Populate the diagram with these causes. Finally, analyze the diagram to identify the most likely root causes of the problem. This process ensures a structured approach to root cause analysis. Let's look at a practical example. Suppose we have a high defect rate in a production line. We would start with the problem statement, high defect rate. Then, we use the six M's to analyze possible causes. For instance, under man, we might find inadequate training. Under machine, perhaps we have outdated equipment. This method helps in categorizing and visualizing the potential causes effectively. Once all potential causes are listed, the next step is to analyze and prioritize them. We use a prioritization matrix to evaluate the likelihood and impact of each cause. This helps in focusing efforts on the most impactful causes first, ensuring that we address the root of the problem effectively. After identifying the root causes, we develop countermeasures for each one. An implementation plan is then created to put these countermeasures into action. It's crucial to monitor the effectiveness of these measures to ensure that they are addressing the root cause and improving the situation as expected. The fishbone diagram offers several benefits. It provides a structured approach to problem solving and encourages team collaboration by involving multiple perspectives. It helps in identifying multiple potential causes for a problem rather than focusing on just one. The visual representation makes complex problems easier to understand and analyze. Praxi provides simple yet powerful tools for fishbone and root cause analysis management, as well as dozens of other process solutions. Contact your representative to learn more. In conclusion, the fishbone diagram is an invaluable tool for root cause analysis in lean problem solving. Start applying this tool to real scenarios in your workplace to practice and refine your skills. And now that you're ready, complete your assessment today.